So now let's see how we can work around with emitter gravity inside of Blender. So in order to work around with the gravity setting of emitter, first of all, I'm going to add in an emitter. So I'm just going to go to mesh. I'm going to add in a UV sphere and then I'm going to add in uh, particles. So I'm just going to go around and then click on the plus button. And there you go. There's the particle right here. So by default, you can see that the particles actually fall below right here. So it actually falls down. So if you want to change around its gravity, then you can go down over here. And then what you can do is you can work around with where this actually falls down. So I'm just going to go around and then expand the force weights right here. And here you can see gravity is one. I can increase the strength of the gravity by pressing two. You can see that it pulls on the particles even more, or I can do 10. So it's the 10 times gravity right here. And if I were to do this, if I were to do minus one right here, you can see that it actually falls upwards right here. So now the gravity is on the opposite side. If you want to make it slow, so I can also go, uh, go and press minus 0 0.4, just like this. And then you can see that it slowly falls um, on uh, like above the surface right here. And that is how the gravity actually works. And that is how you can work around with emitter gravity inside of Blender. So I hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.